Have you ever wondered how a tsunami really happens? It's not just a big wave. It's one of nature's most powerful chain reactions. Most tsunamis begin with a massive earthquake under the ocean. When tectonic plates suddenly shift, the seafloor moves up or down, instantly displacing millions of tons of water. Like dropping a stone into a pond, ripples spread outward. But here, those ripples are enormous and can travel at jet speed, up to 900 kilometers per hour, across entire oceans. Out in the deep sea, a tsunami wave might look small, just a meter high, so ships barely notice it. But as it approaches land, the shallow seabed slows it down. The energy has nowhere to go but upward, turning it into a towering wall of water. A tsunami doesn't strike as just one wave, it comes in a series. Sometimes the first wave is small, while the largest crashes minutes later, catching people off guard. When it finally hits, it can flood coastlines, sweeping away everything in its path. So next time you hear the word tsunami, remember, it's not just a wave, it's the ocean itself in motion. Want more mind-blowing explanations like this? Subscribe to Intriguing Facts channel and keep exploring the wonders of our world.